Can y'all hear me? <clears throat> Hello, I'm finally here. Hopefully you can hear me. My computer was hung up. It wouldn't allow me to change the screen so that I could go live. It was showing it was connected, but it was stuck. <laughs> so, yay, I'm glad you can hear me. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Well, those of you that are here, most of you know who I am, but I am Linda Israel, and welcome to the live stream on June the 3rd. Today, we're going to use the Punked Out Steam creative subscription box that I offer to make a junk journal. If you're here today, thank you for being here. I greatly appreciate your support. Please keep your comments in the chat chat uplifting and happy and positive if you will if you do need to share because you would like some well wishes or thoughts or good wishes or vibes do check out the friendly junk journal people facebook group we have an event called we care and that's where you can paste that or post that you are wanting some good well wishes or thoughtful uh uh I can't even get my words out. <laughs> Good vibes, that kind of stuff. So check that out. <clears throat> if you're watching this in the replay, know that just below my face, there's a little gear that you'll be able to speed that up to two times the speed to get through this video faster. So those of you that are here today, welcome, welcome, welcome. I do believe I have started the giveaway, but I'm going to make sure that it is open and that you can go ahead and enter the raffle. We're going to give away 200 junk bucks. You're probably wondering what junk bucks are. So I'm going to change the screen so you can see that. Junk bucks are currency that you earn while watching the live streams, while chatting here, as well as your donations. And when you get to 2,000 junk bucks, you can type award and trade those for a $10 coupon to my store. I hope I've gotten everybody from last week that was supposed to get a coupon. If I didn't, please let me know. Message me. You can do it through my website or you can do it through Facebook. <clears throat> so thank you for being here. I greatly appreciate that. Um, you can make a donation to win the journal that I am going to have at the end of this stream. And it can be any donation you so choose. You can use the super chat feature on YouTube or you can use the stream labs where I get all of the money on YouTube. I only, I get less than 30% or I get the amount minus 30%. So they take a 30% cut here on YouTube. And just so you know, we're going to do a minimum raffle, uh, our donation, our threshold is $100 because we are using the punked out steam subscription box which is valued at $24.99 <clears throat> the printed punked out steam kit which is valued at $14.99 the punked out steam planner kit which is valued at $9.99 the punked out steam paint kit which is valued at $25.99 a custom printed journal cover handmade by me which is valued at $27.99 and then we're going to use the stencil club for May which is $19.99. If you have any questions during the stream do put them in all caps. If I don't see it please forgive me because a lot's going on and I may not see it right away so please ask again. One of my admins may also repost it for me as well. So <clears throat> bad YouTube. I know it was uh my computer system was showing that I was connected, but it wouldn't let me go live on the screen. So I was like, what is going on here? So I'm glad we got that worked out. <clears throat> and welcome, welcome, welcome. I see lots of people in here. I see Chronic Crafter and Sonia and Robin and T. Lily and let's see, Carrie Ann, Giovanna and... Uh, who is that? That's Norella. Yay. So glad you're here. Hey, Janice. Hey, Julie. Hey, Marie. If I don't call out your name, it's because I, I'm scrolling backwards and I'm trying to get it. Left Hand Crafters, glad you're here. Daily Gotcha Wolf, which is Barbara. And let's see, Barbara Oliver and Tina A. And Kathy Lake and Sherry Deskins and Tina A. I think I've got just about everybody. Let me scroll back up. And Annika. Hey, Crazy Lady, a.k.a. Sonia, donated. <laughs> Thank you so much, Sonia, for your donation. So she's gotten it started. <clears throat> 
All right. And Angelica. Hey, Barbie. Angelica Barbie. Glad to see you here as well. All right. So I'm just kind of scrolling down. I may not have everybody. Hello. 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 All righty. <clears throat> So today, what I've got here is, this is the journal that comes in the subscription box. It, mine was printed at home. Yours in the box will be printed on 100 pound cardstock with a laser printer. It will be two-sided, just like this one is. And then the pages inside are six, or yeah, what is that? Three sheets of paper that are two-sided and they're stapled bound in the center. So we would take these apart so that we would have some pages. And what we're gonna do is I've grabbed a few sheets of paper here and we're gonna decorate these. I want this to be mostly what I consider, thank you so much, Barbara, for your donation, a writing journal, a place that you would write things into the journal. <clears throat> Pardon me. <clears throat> I have a little frog in my throat that wants to visit today. I've also fussy cut all the items, the elements that are part of the subscription box. And then the other journals will be, thank you Robin for your donation, will be made with the um, printed kit as well. Or you can use the um, digital download for the large journal kit. I love Calico Collage's work too. Norella does an amazing job. I'm so glad that she's here to be a helpmate to me, a partner, if you will. So thank you, thank you, thank you. Hey, Annika, thank you for your donation. And Sherry, thank you for your donation as well. Robin, thank you for donation. I greatly appreciate it. All right. <clears throat> Your nurse just left. Yay, Christy. So glad you're here. All right, so what we're going to do is I've gone ahead and grabbed some paper. I've got three pages that are out of a composition notebook. And I've shown this before, but I thought I would show it again today just to give you an idea. So a composition notebook is a notebook that's usually stitched down the middle and I unpick those stitches and when you do you end up with a full great big sheet that you can use for journal pages. Pardon me while I do this. I think my screen is not right. <laughs> thank you Christy for your donation. I greatly appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And then you can trim this to be the size that you want. If you were to use a standard piece of notebook paper and you wanted to use that as a page, you would have to fold it in half and then the lines would be going up and down, which may not be a problem. Maybe you want to have your lines going up and down, but I wanted mine to be the correct way, okay? So I've got those. I've got a couple of sheets of some really nice linen paper. And then in the kit, you get three pages of this salmon colored paper. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna use some stencils and stamping and we're gonna decorate these pages. So let me get my spray box out. And we're gonna grab the Almost Gears stencil. And just so y'all can get a sneak peek, this is the cover so far of the journal. And this time when I printed or had Henry print it, he put my logo on here. So it's got my logo as part of the cover. And we will be decorating it some more here in just a moment. <clears throat> All righty. This is a page I made earlier, so I'm going to save that. All right, so first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to grab one of these peach papers or salmon colored papers. And we're going to use the Almost Gears stencil that comes in the subscription box. And then also in the subscription box comes a peachy colored or coral color of Tattered Angels. We called it Punked Out Steam. And I'm shaking it up because it has a lot of mica in the bottom. You're loving my cover. Thank you so much, Norella. Thank you so much. Thank you, Carrie Ann, for your donation. All right, so I'm shaking this up really well. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You're very welcome, Carrie Ann. Thank you. I, I really appreciate y'all's support. I really do. Um, if you have a subscription with me, you might want to check by going to my account that everything is in order. 
I think some people forget that there are some links that you have to click on an email to confirm your order. I had a couple of them fail here this past couple of days, and I think it's because they didn't follow the, the links on their emails. So if you haven't gotten an email about your order recently, you might go ahead and log in, and then you can check the status there if it went through or not. Thank you, Chrissy, for your donation. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <clears throat> oh, we got a boss fight going on. Carrie Ann, or there's no, Chronic Craft, or Carrie Ann started, I see now. Boss. So if you play the in games, those are little games in the chat that you pay junk bucks, I think it's 10, and then you're able to play the little game, and then you can, um, possibly win a bunch. What two colors could make up that peach if I don't have it? Well, um, do you have other Tattered Angels at the moment? Because I don't think in my past kits I've had this peachy color at all. Um, that's why I picked it, because I hadn't had it in the kits. I'm trying to think. I don't know what colors you could use. You could probably get away with using a little bit of the walnut uh, gold or um, see in the Bella kit there was a Bella gold I think is what it's called and I'm trying to think what other color. You could probably mix it with a little bit of a pink if you have some pinks as well and add a little bit of gold to it. You could add a little bit of blue as well, just to kind of give it something different. So that's one side of the pages. <clears throat> pink and orange gold. Yep, pink, orange, gold, exactly. Um, I don't think I have an orange in any of the other kits. Um, as well, except for the orange, the outrageous orange, that had orange in it. So if you got that kit, you have a little bit of orange in that. <clears throat> yes, that stencil comes in the subscription box. Yes, it does. That is called Almost Gears. Nice. That's what it looks like when you spray through the stencil. And then this is what it looks like when you mop up. Does that help you, Julie? Give you a little bit more information about choose some orange or... Okay. Experiment and play. Yeah, you don't want to miss this one because I love this gear stencil. I designed it. I hand drew it. I have a iPad and a drawing app on the iPad and it allows me to go in and create the stencil designs that y'all have seen in my uh, creativity. I think what I'm going to do is I know I'm making personally for myself another journal. Okay so yours says it's being processed. Okay then if yours is saying processed then you're good Barbara. Your order will be shipped out on June the 15th. So I'm going to be making my own journal to keep because I really love this kit and I wanted to have my own. So I've been making a few mop-up pages to save so I can make my own journal to keep because I love how this has turned out so far. Alright, so we've got that sprayed. And I'm going to flip this over. What I like to do is I flip over my pages. And if the color didn't come all the way through, I might use the stencil again. But a lot of times, I'll just spray on top of it. And it'll just give it a nice shimmer. Yeah, I'm going to make a journal for myself, Robin. <laughs> I understand, Julie. I understand. I understand when you have to, uh, uh, you know plan and not spend too much. <laughs> I go through that a lot. Henry told me the other day I couldn't buy any plants for our yard so I've been waiting. I wished I would have thought earlier in the year and bought some seeds 
so that I could plant some seeds but I didn't and now it's too late for seeds really I guess I could get a few but there's hard to come by now so I've been saving my money so that I can buy a few plants to put out in my garden if y'all didn't see my garden you can check it out through my Facebook page lindaisrael.com uh, or excuse me Linda Israel on Facebook I haven't posted it on my blog I guess I should <clears throat> all right the next stencil I'm going to use let me find it here we go we'll use this one this one is called connected gears I'm going to put it on top of that grid paper and this time I'm going to do some different colors here I'm going to grab a few here I think this is what I want okay I'm trying to get them in order that I want them. So I've got the darker blue that comes in the punked out steam kit. You, if you want the digital kit in addition to uh, your subscription box, you can get the digital with the subscription box for $10.99. That's for the add-on journal. That is two journal covers. It is seven two-sided pages and six fussy cut items. Um, that is an available for $10.99 with the subscription box. If you don't want the subscription box, but you just want the digital download of the journal kit, then you can get the virtual subscription for $14.99 every two months. Yeah, I need to uh, ask around for a few cuttings. <clears throat> I know, plants go under the house budget. <laughs> <laughs> what else yeah I need you to ask around join the raffle if you haven't already join the raffle for the junk bucks and then here in just a moment we'll do um, another tutorial or another uh, uh, I can't get my words out today another uh, giveaway all right so I did the dark blue and then I'm gonna add a little bit of the teal on either side so that kind of deepens it then I'm going to grab the green that's from the punked out steam kit. Make sure I get it. And then the corners will be kind of green. And then I'm going to grab another sheet of paper here and we'll mop up. Yeah, plant some cuttings. I, I do have a few um, plants that I have cut myself and put in my yard. What I really want is it's called an exotic love vine one of my friends shared it with me online and I just love the way it looks and I want it to go in my backyard on my uh, privacy wall that we built so I'm hoping that I can find some either in seed format or the actual vine all right so here's what it looks like when you mop up what do you think of that I just love the colors blending together. I'm going to dry this just a little bit. You love succulents. Succulents are pretty. Yeah, a poison ivy is no fun for sure. I do have a few um, succulents or what they call them, um, hen and chicks, I think is what one name is called. I have a few of those in the front yard. And then I have... Uh, Lots of ivy around our tree. I have tons of lilies. Lots of lilies. Oh, yeah. You don't want a baby playing with the, uh, the cactus, do you? <laughs> oh, that's awesome, Barbara. I want a greenhouse as well. We have a shed in our backyard that is sorely needing some uh, refabrication or updating. And so we're hoping, because we replaced windows last year on the back of our house, that I can use some of those windows to make a greenhouse. That's something that we're trying to look into doing as well. You know, I don't know, Julie. She is in Texas, so I may send her a message and see if she would mail one to me. Ask me where it is. <laughs> where is it, Barbara? Where is it? Chicks and bitties. Yes, Sonia. Uh.
He's a wild one. <laughs> so that's what it looks like using that color. So let's do a different stencil now. So I'm going to put this one in here. I'm getting out of the camera, camera shop, shop. Sorry about that. Yeah, I think I might. I may send her a message. She was like, this is what you need. And I should send to her a message and say, okay, but if that's what I need, you should send me some. <laughs> I love getting plants from friends and being able to um, say that that's where it came from. It's kind of cool. Oh, yeah, you got succulents are okay if you can get them and a little bit of water every once in a while. Okay, now this time I'm going to use the pink that's in the punked out steam. So I'm going to start that in the middle. Then I'm going to use a little bit of the teal color. And then we're going to use the darker blue on the edges. Oh my gosh, that's terrible, Mariana. Henry got into um, poison ivy a few years ago. Our office or building that we own had poison ivy growing up in the back. And Henry went out there thinking, I'm just going to rip all this out and get rid of it. And when he did, it came to pass that he is very allergic to poison ivy. And apparently you can become allergic to poison ivy if you've never been allergic. I grew up around it. I have not touched it since, and I don't plan on touching it just in case I have an allergic reaction to it. <laughs> All right, so that is this side. Now, this paper is a little bit thicker than the other papers that I've been using, so I'm going to turn the stencil over. I'm going to go ahead and spritz this one as well. And I'm going to kind of go a little crazy with the color. Add a little bit of green in there. I love this kind of rainbow effect. You like my, this one's called Connected Gears. Connected Gears. And that's in my shop. That's available in my shop now. I like the way it turns out. I got a little, I got a little crazy with the uh, spraying, but that's okay. It's all right. We just get that really, uh, almost like a tea dine vibe uh, look, huh? I'm looking for an exotic love vine, tea lily. Um, apparently, it's a fast-growing vine, and it puts off kind of an orange to red trumpet-looking. Uh, flower on it. The hummingbirds like it and it's very quick growing. No such thing as too much tattered angels. I got a little bit much on there but I think it looks pretty good. Yeah that you gotta get rid of that uh, poison ivy. It'll get you. It will get you. And this is where I peeled it off. Isn't that kind of cool? All right, I'm going to flip this over. Lavender strikes really easy. You know, I have some lavender um, that I bought a year ago. It was on clearance at our local um, plant center, if you will. And it's come back really well this year. I've been really happy with it. All right, so this is the stained glass gears. It's part of the May Stencil Club. It comes with uh, three other stencils. So I'm just kind of putting that in here. I love it. I love the mixing of the colors. Alrighty, so let's, um, let me go ahead. Yeah, you like the different colors on one stencil, Robin? I think it's kind of fun to be able to add different colors on there. 
And I like, you know, I can spray one side and then lay another piece of paper down and you get two for one. It's kind of fun. Yeah, Dawn dish uh, liquid and vinegar. You, what you got to do is you got to uh, cut the oil that happens whenever you are um, exposed to poison ivy. And all of your clothing will have that oil on it. You want to try to get rid of it as, on everything. Do you need cold climate plants? Yes. I need plants that are okay in the winter. We do get um, sometimes as low as uh, zero, zero Fahrenheit here in Oklahoma. It can get really cold in the winters. We usually don't go below zero here, but it is possible. That's how I lost all of my passion vine two years ago. We had a deep, deep, deep freeze for many, many days. and. My passion vine never came back. Yeah, that stencil club is available um, in my shop. You can choose when you buy the June stencil club and you click buy, there is a comment field and you can say, I would like the May stencil club or if you want both, you can buy two of them. That's up to you. All right, so this time, I'm going to do peach, I'm going to do the yellow, and I'm going to do the green. Thank you so much, Janice, for your donation. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And I think I'm going to do the teal. So it just kind of fades all the way across. Grab another sheet of paper. Like so. So, you know, a lot of people like to tea dye paper or coffee dye paper. I don't. Um, it's a long, messy process as far as I'm concerned. And so I would rather make the pages as I am making my journal. So that's why I don't make tea dye papers. I'm going to save that one for later. Yeah, you like those, Barbara? You got the connected gears. It's a fun one. Ooh, look at that. It kind of has a rainbow effect. Let me move my box, and then you can see it a little better. It's got beautiful shimmer in it as well. Kill that plant. You might want to get some uh, heavy-duty weed killer. There's some that's just for... Uh, poison Ivy, Mariana, check out your local garden center or home improvement. Go tell them that you're trying to kill Poison Ivy. And there's a spray that you can put on the plant. The vinegar and Dawn dish soap that you were talking about is for getting rid of it when it's on your body already. The junk jar has $19 in it so far, Robin says. What do you think of that page? I like it. It's kind of pretty. Dig it up. You need this stencil. This is part of the um, May Stencil Club. Isn't that cool? And this is the other side. I just love the way this comes together. This one is called, um, what is it? Uh, Stained glass gears, and it's part of the May Stencil Club. All right, so now we've got a few pages here. And I think what I want to do, I'm trying to decide if I want to stamp it on the pages first or just go ahead and put them together. Let's do the drawing first, and then I will start putting these pages together. How's that sound? You like it? I love being able to have all these bright, pretty pages with the journal kit. So now I've got all these pieces that I can put on there. A rainbow stencil page. That's what we can do with this punked out steam kit. We can have all the color that we want. Hey, Dee Dee, so glad to see you're here. Hey, hey. Hey, uh, uh, Elizabeth.
Elizabeth, well, glad to have you here. All right, join the raffle. If you haven't already, join the raffle. And then I'm going to take a drink, and then we're going to do the raffle drawing. How many of y'all are in the Junk Journal Camp Retreat? I was there this morning. I still have my my camp t-shirt on for the junk journal camp retreat. I believe you can still buy uh, admittance to the camp if you would like to attend. Uh, today was the first day. There were a bunch of tutorials that were shared today and you can for sure catch up and be able to enjoy all that. It's only, I think it was $25. Um, Sonia might post the link here in a moment. There it is, it just went up. Um, it's still an active, Thing, so come check it out okay all right everybody's in the giveaway all right let's pick a winner who's gonna get 200 junk bucks Vicki Whitehead congratulations you have won 200 junk bucks and I will award those at the end so be on the lookout for that today is june the third punked out steam all right so let me get the next item that we're going to put for the giveaway i've got a little bag here somewhere here it is all right okay so, I've got these stickers. You're very welcome, Vicki. Congratulations. I've got these little stickers. I'm, I'm putting my fingers over them because I don't want somebody to try to mess them up. What these are are stickers that you can add to a greeting card, your junk journal, a photo album, and you can attach a video. So, for example, if I did this to give as a gift to a friend or something what i could do is put this little sticker in like the front cover and say hey thanks so much for being my friend i really appreciate you i hope you enjoy using this journal something like that and they can watch that video over and over and over again so we're going to give away two of these packs i think there's is there four per yeah four stickers per pack so we're going to put this up here good reset Yes, and we're going to go um, video stickers, and they are by, um, what is that, Pen, Penless, Penless, I believe is it's called, P-E-N-L-E-S-S, -E -E so it's cool little Penless Messages is the, who that's by, so we're going to open that up. And that is the next prize that we're going to have. Let's set this over here. All right, so now, uh, get in the raffle. I joined, but don't know how to get. Okay, um, Connie, if you join the virtual retreat, then you just need to go to the Facebook group and you should have a link if you don't message me and i will give you the link to get to the group or i'll connect you with penny so she can get you in the group okay all righty okay so sonia says that she think the price went up a few dollars but yes you can join today and uh, you will get your money back in the percentage you shave on shops so because there's lots of goodies in fact i have a discount that whenever you join the retreat if you want to purchase my daydreaming kit you get a discount this is a kit that norella did the artwork for and i added my own stencil and tattered angels and lots of goodies with it Oh, thank you, Sonia, for saying so. There's lots of vendors in there. I'm really impressed with how many people are there. All right, so let's start with this. I'm going to grab the first pages, and I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a pile here of all the pages and then the cover. And I'm going to just pick these up, and we're going to pick, I think, that one there, this one there. Yeah, like this. So... I've got this all lined up. 
So we've got one journal page that comes with the kit. And then the next one is, it's rather wet still. I may need to dry it some more. Oh, we got a boss fight. Yeah, Norella has a store specifically for the camp retreat. She has items in there that you can't get in her regular store. Not yet, anyway. After the retreat, they'll probably be available. Alright, so all I'm doing is I'm alternating each one. And I think I want that in the center. I think I like that one the most. Okay, we're going to put that one last. I know, I'm all over the place here. So, I'm just picking up a page putting it in, picking up the next page, putting it in until I have all these pages picked up. And there are one, two, three, four, five, is that right? Different pages. Yeah. Now they're out of order for some reason. How did I manage to do that? I guess I was talking, so I didn't pay attention to what I was doing. This one goes there. This one goes here and here. Okay. All right. Here we go. That's what happened. They got separated, so then I got out of order. <laughs> out of order! And somehow I did it again. I think this one's supposed to go here, and this one's supposed to go here. See, I mess up too, y'all. <laughs> okay, so now... Uh-oh, is Junkie Joe being mean to you? You didn't win this time? <laughs> hey, Lynn! So glad you're here. Welcome, welcome. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and bind this, I think. Thank you, Christy, for your donation. Oh, yeah, die cut some gears and randomly spritz those. Those would be awesome, Julie. Yeah. Poison ivy can be no fun. No bueno. <laughs> no bueno. All right, Sonia, will do. I'll scream out and say, Sonia, where are you? <laughs> uh, he's picking on you. <laughs> Junkie Joe is evil. That's what everybody says. He's just a robot, y'all. <laughs> oh, my goodness. I think so too, Bonnie. I think that she could spray all those gears different colors and have a lot of fun with those. For sure. You didn't say that? <laughs> no fun is right, Mariana. Yes, I did butterflies. I did butterflies. I did, I did, I did. All right, so we're going to do this. Let's put this in here. I'm grabbing my needle. So this is the quick way to add more pages to your subscription box journal. I'm going to do three links of wax linen thread. And I sell book binders needles in my shop. You get two for $5. And next one I'm going to do is I'm going to go in the center. And we're going to do a pamphlet stitch. <laughs> Junkie Joe might have feelings. <clears throat> you don't have ways to do die cut, Christy? Well, that's probably good that you get a couple of die cut. Actually, they're laser cut gears in the subscription box. <laughs> Junkie Joe's has feelings. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Alright, so now I'm going to tie this off. 
Yeah, with dyes, they are. You can do all kinds of things. Different kinds of papers and spray them with tattered angels. Paint them with acrylic paint. There's lots of things that you can do for sure. All right, so I'm going to put my binding tools away. Hey, Regina! He's a robot! <laughs> okay, oh, I forgot my paper clips. Put the paper clips away because I'll need them again sometime. <laughs> he has a brain like burnt toast. <laughs> All right, so earlier I had punched some little hearts out of the scrap area from the fussy cut items. And what I'm going to do is place just a little bit of glue on one of these hearts. And then I'm going to grab one of the strings from binding the journal and lay that string right in there. And then I'll grab another heart and I'll back those. So I'll put the backs together and press them together and then that will cover the end of our little string here oh no terry well i hope you feel better thanks for stopping in no fun to not feel well i understand that completely Go ahead and enter the raffle if you're going to be here for a few minutes. We're giving away some cool stickers that you can use to add a video to a journal or a greeting card. Alrighty. Join the raffle. Alright, so there... So as you can see, the stencil designs on the front cover, and then it's also right in the middle. So that was because of Norella. She used some of that design uh, whenever we were putting things together. All right, I think what I want to do now is I'm going to use this. It's part of the fussy cut items that come with the subscription box. And I think I'm going to go ahead and glue this on the front cover. And we'll add that as steampunk. Like that, what do you think? These are the other fussy cut items as well, so I'll kind of open this up. And let's just start, let's start in the middle. Let's start in the middle and work our way. So what do we want in the middle? And I've got one of these strips. Let's see if that's what I want. <laughs> because this could go behind it, right? as a belly band and then I know I saw a couple of little pieces here I'm kind of looking around to see what I got these are some of the pages that I made on the mixed media Thursday last Thursday um, these are now also a digital download that you can get from my shop I think is that what we want to do or do we want to do this let's get a piece of craft cardstock here and see i think that could be a little pocket here so i'm going to trim this and make a pocket to put in here oh thank you regina for your donation thank you so very much all right so i'm going to go right about there I'm going to grab a sheet of paper just to use for my background here so I don't get a mess everywhere. And I've got, I've got the gear stamp here. And somewhere I have my ink pad. So I'm going to use some archival ink. This is the gear stamp that I have in my shop. And I'm going to stamp this repeatedly over this piece of craft cardstock. Okay. Put that away, put this over here, and I think that looks pretty good, doesn't it? Now let's add some distress inks to the edges. You love the word searches? They're so much fun! They're so much fun. I'll let you, I'll put it there so you can see it. 
as I distress this piece of paper. Are you distressed yet? <laughs> All righty. So now I'm going to put this guy right on top of there. And that'll give us a nice little pocket. And thank you for your thumbs up. I really appreciate it. Thank you for your kind comments. You know, and if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. I greatly appreciate that. I'm trying to do a few more special giveaways because I finally reached 10,000 subscribers and it's because of wonderful people like you. So thank you so much. All right, so let's put this guy down and let's put this guy down. So I'm gonna, this is from the large journal kit. You like it? You like the gear stand? Thank you, Norella. Thank you, Mariana, for your donation. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I greatly appreciate it. All right, so I'm going to put that right in the middle here. And then we're going to put this guy over here. So I'm going to move the tassels out of the way. And I'm just going to make it a pocket. So I'm going to go down the side, across the bottom, and then back up the side again. And I'm not putting a whole lot of glue on there. It's just a little bit. And we're going to center that on the page and glue that down. All right, so we know that this guy's going to go underneath there. And so I don't use it somewhere else. I think I'm going to put, maybe we'll put this one in here. Yeah, we'll put this one in here. So now I'm going to just flip this over. And I think what I'm going to do now is I have a little journal stamp here somewhere under this pile. Will that fit? It will. So I've got this little scrap of craft paper. And so I'm going to use the journal quartet and stamp that right in the center of this piece. There. And then let's add some distress ink to it. You like the word search? Thank you so much, Julie. Oh yeah, do some stamping and watercolor them and cut them out. I love doing that. It's a lot of fun. In fact, that's what this is. I stamped all of those and watercolored them and they're ready for me to cut out. And I think what I want, I'm going to stamp on this side. So I'm going to put a piece of paper here so I don't get any ink on the rest of my page. And I've got the, I think it's a clockwork. I can't remember. It's a clock-like stamp, and I'm going to put that in the corner here. And then I have one of the little cars that I think is on the road again is the name of it. So we're going to stamp that right here in the corner, like that. And then, let's see here. Oh, I've got one of these other gears. So we're just going to kind of make a little quick collage right there. What have you missed, Sonia? We're, we're still putting things together. We're using your favorite things, rubber stamps, <laughs> Sonia. We're using rubber stamps. Sonia likes a few rubber stamps. Every time I add something, she wants me to send it to them. I want some more stamps. And I'm like, okay. <laughs> I've got more stamps to add, but I haven't yet because I'm waiting. I think what I want to do, we've got this little guy. I'm going to put him across the bottom. He kind of blends with the page, but he'll be good to put a little tuck spot there. Tell your story. Oh, that would be a good one, Christy. I like that. Tell your story. That might be something I can work on. I'm supposed to be making rubber stamps, but I haven't yet. Oh, thank you, Margie. You're so sweet. Thank you so much for your donation. You know, I really appreciate you. You are such a doll. I hope you're the winner today. Because <laughs> I really appreciate your support. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, so let's put this guy right here. Like that. And then I have one of these cards that I made from the Mixed Media Day that would go cute there. And I've got another one here. So we got a couple that can go there. 
So let's stamp this guy. I keep putting my stamp pad away. And we'll put that right there. So I'll have a little bit of journal spots. And I've got a little butterfly. So I'm just going to stick that down right there. This is one of my fussy cut items that I made by stamping and coloring with watercolor ink. Or Tattered Angels. Gosh, I can't get it out. I think... What else do we got? Oh, we have one of these Admit One tickets. So let's put that over here. Whatever happens, happens. <laughs> Your chop liver, uh, Mariana. That's right. <laughs> well, you know, Margie did donate $20 and has consistently donated $20 when she comes here and she has not won a journal yet so if she wins I would be ecstatic <laughs> uh, kissing up to Joe so you can become a winner Mar uh, so Sonia that would be a good idea right <laughs> alrighty I think I'm kind of digging around in here I made these little labels. These are called the enamel stamps. And I stamped it onto a mixed media piece of paper. So I'm going to cut one of these out really fast. I love using these little Fisker scissors because it allows me to get in here and cut these without hurting my hands. All right. <laughs> You would faint, Margie. Please don't faint unless you're sitting down or laying in your bed because I don't want you to get injured. Hey, Lynn, thank you so much for your donation. All right, let's do this. Let's just kind of stick that down just for decoration. Yeah, I saw it. I saw it, Sonia. You just keep doing that. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I think that looks pretty cute don't you you liking it just kind of this is to me is just the writing journal a place to write things down all right so this is going to go in here it should be dry now and this one could go in here so that's the center of our journal so let's go the other way now and let's add some stuff on here i've got another little strip of paper here let's um let's see what other rubber stamps i have Let's do this guy. Let me find a... I need more stamp blocks. I can't ever find my stamp blocks. <laughs> They're always somewhere else. Okay, I think if we put this guy up here. I'm going to stamp... This is the... Um, I think it's World, World Traveler? World something. It's the Hemispheres. Oh, thank you, Kay, for your donation. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And I think it'll fit right there. I'm going to stamp it twice. And then I'll fussy cut this out really fast. And I think we'll use this on top of that strip. I'm not being precise. I'm just quickly cutting it out. All right. And then I'm going to use some distress ink on the edges. Don't say eight. Hey, your mother will faint. Your father will fall in and a bucket of paint. That's funny. <laughs> Now, Mariana, you're not old enough to have been alive when Lincoln was alive. I think I'm going to do that and that. I think that's kind of cute. What do you think? Just adding different layers on top of the kit. And I think what I might do down here is I've got that gear stamp somewhere. Where is it? Where'd you put it, Linda? It's disappeared. I just moved it over here. I must have covered it up. Oh my goodness. 
Oh, there it is. That's why I couldn't see it. It was turned around backwards. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to stamp down here right off the page just so we can have a little gear every once in a while. All right, so I'm going to put this up here with these other stamps <laughs> so I can find them. Okay. There's a piece I didn't cut out, so we'll save that. All right, so let's let's glue this down. Don't tell anybody, Mariana. <laughs> you woke up from your real-time nap in your virtual camp cabin. <laughs> That's awesome, Jenny. Are you having fun in the camp? Are you learning anything new? Are you are you having fun fellowshipping with others? Oh, thank you, Terry, for your donation. Thank you so very much. <laughs> I'm having fun. I, I've been watching the videos today and trying to prep for the live stream here. I think that'll look cute right there. I'm going to make it a tuck spot, but I'm not going to put anything in it just yet. I may put something in it later, but it'll be a, a tuck spot at the top here. Like so. Steampunk! Oh, Sherry, yes, I have added some essential oils to my uh, Tattered Angels in the past. Um, I think I used sandalwood in one of the walnut gold. When I got it, it kind of smelled bad because <laughs> it was an old stock, I think. And so I put a couple of drops in it and it smells wonderful. I had lots of comments every time I used that in a journal. And then I got afraid that someone would be allergic. So I tried not to do it very often. Okay, so let's see here. Let's put a little something on this side of the page. I think we can get away with, let's stamp the truck over here. I think that's what I want to do. I've got this other truck that goes the other direction. So we'll stamp it over here. New Subby, thank you. Thank you for subscribing. Oop. Thank you, thank you, Lynn. Oh, rose would be good, too. Yeah, that would smell wonderful. Lavender would be good. Thank you, Deborah, for your donation. Thank you so very much. Look, I put the little on-the-road-again truck down here in the corner. I think if I put this little rose in there in the corner, then we can use it to be a tuck spot. Maybe for... This guy kind of peeking out behind. Yeah, let's do that. Maybe I'll even go another step. Maybe I'll put him on top of that so it's a little bit bigger. So we're going to stamp on this again. Have you missed much? No, not too much. Uh, I sprayed some papers with Tattered Angels and used different stencils. So that's what is going on here, Deborah. And then right here is another one of the pages that I sprayed. And so now I'm just kind of adding a few decorations to the pages. Thank you, Jenny, for your donation. We do have a drawing going on right now. So if you'll enter that in just a moment, I'm going to finish this element on the page. And I will draw for the winner of the next drawing, okay? That cat is too cute, isn't it? I think it's pretty darling. I think he's going to go right there. So we're going to put this. And I'm doing that just so that I have a little bit more space to hold this piece of paper. Okay. Thank you, Christy, for your donation. Thank you so much. Sweet. Oh, sweet orange oil. Yeah, that would be good, too, that you could put in. If you like orange, it would smell so amazing. It doesn't take much, just a few drops. All right, we're going to put this right here. All right, do I have... All right, so I do have something across the top there, so I know that 
the word journal isn't going to bleed through. So I'm going to stamp that there. All right, so everybody entered into the raffle. Gardening around the lavender. Yeah, and mint. Oh, yeah, that would be good, too. More glue, more glitter. <laughs> All right, we're going to put that right there. I don't want to poke it down in too far because I don't want it to get stuck in the glue. All right, are we entered in the raffle? I'm going to give you another moment, and then I will draw for a winner. Winner, winner. All righty. Got little cars here. I like just doing the little word journal and adding that every once in a while. I don't know. It's just kind of fun. I may not put it here, but I wanted to get one ready. <laughs> All right, let's put, I've got one of these little bees. We'll put it across the corner. Let's stamp that. Are y'all ready for the raffle? All right, we're going to stamp this, and then we're going to put this little bee on the top of it. Yeah, you could do a fragrance that matches. True, true, true. <laughs> Journal. All righty, let's put that right here. What do you think? That's kind of cute, right? All right, so... journal <laughs> you know I need to do that with um, what do I need to do I need to go here and go here I like the journal quartet it's a smaller stamp set so I'll get that link so you can have it oh it might help I do journal stamp journal stamp I'm trying to find the link <laughs> there it is all right copy that and go like this and then we'll go over here so now we're gonna go to this one we're gonna add one we're gonna call it journal quartet here is the four journal rubber stamps there we go all right. All right. Anybody have a question? Subway is the bomb. <laughs> Subway's pretty good. I haven't eaten Subway in a while. Too many carbs. Too many carbs. All right. So let me go to the giveaway and let me find my pen again. And let's see who's the winner of the stickers. The winner is JT. JT, are you here? I don't know who that is because it's initials. So I need you to pipe up in the chat. And if you could, please contact me through my website. So if you just go exclamation point contact. And that way I can get your... Uh, mailing address so I can mail the stickers to you okay JT you won congratulations since I hear from you then I can go through the next person or in the next um, giveaway item what do I want to give away this time well I know what we'll do okay okay I've got the next item that's your dad's name. Congratulations, JT. I think I like that. Um, let's see what else we got here. I'm trying to see what else I've got here. We got this as flying ships. So we'll stick that on there. Oh, Deborah Vick. Congratulations. Let me write that down and I'll get a coupon code sent over to you here in just a little bit
coupon. All right. There's JT. Yay. You're very welcome, JT. Now make sure that you message me through my website with your mailing address. All right. So contact. Junkie Joe's going to send you, say, show that. And then I'm going to start the next raffle, okay? All righty. All right, so let's get the next raffle started. Congratulations. All right, reset. Yes. And then we got another giveaway. This time I'm going to give away, these are two little rubber stamp sets. Um, Doodle Bug Design Ink. They're just little different uh, elements that you can use. And this one is from Teresa Collins. Check Chic Baby Girl Clear Stamp. So they have like thank you and a few other little things on here. These were given to me, so I'm passing them along to y'all. So that is our next raffle. So go ahead and join. Kathy, you still need your coupon code too? I, I wonder if you didn't get my email. But I'll make sure to do that afterwards. You might send me an email. At email me at lindaisrael.com. Um, because for some reason, if I send you a message, it's going to the spam filter. So make sure that you message me and then I'll reply to that. Okay. Raffle. Stamps. Yes, we're going to give away some stamps, Sonia. There's some rubber stamps, or they're clear stamps, not rubber, they're clear stamps. So that's the next one. Raffle! Coffee, Christy says. I need some coffee too. I forgot to make some before I came on today. All right, we're going to put, I think we're going to put that up here. I'm going to stamp the gears again. I don't know. I'm obsessed with the gears. <laughs> okay, thank you, Kathy. Thank you. All right, we'll put that right there. I think that looks kind of cute. Wow, 75 and sunny with real feel of 55. That's That sounds amazing, Jenny. Kind of crisp, cool. You love the journal stamps? Aren't they fun? It's kind of a fun little design that you can use. I think we should use this car stamp again. I think I need another block. Where are my blocks? Who's been running off with my blocks? No talking about carbs. <laughs> no carbs. I don't eat carbs right now. I am down almost 30 pounds. So I don't eat carbs at the moment. They're rare and few between. <laughs> Vanilla coffee. Ooh, that sounds good. <laughs> Come home and make Linda some coffee. <laughs> he says, Linda is capable of making her own coffee. <laughs> All right. Let's stamp some gear. No, let's stamp this one. I don't know. I'm obsessed with this image. I don't know why. It's just kind of fun. All right. Well, let's put something on this side. Maybe we'll do this little flower up here, just for the fun of it. Daddy stole the blocks. <laughs> the gears are turning. <laughs> oh, you are very welcome, Regina. Uh, thank you for coming into my life, you know. I, I really enjoy what I'm doing. I feel so blessed to be able to do this. I was telling... Uh, my trainer at the gym today, who is uh, half my age, he was asking me about my online presence, and I was kind of giving him some tips about it, and I said, you know, I never thought that I would come to make a living sharing stuff online and being in the art industry. I never thought that that would happen. And it has, and it's been amazing. I went ahead and just added a journal card there. This is an altered paper clip. 
just use basically an artist trading card size. This is one of my mixed media pieces. This is one of the elements from the large kit and then that rubber stamp. Aw, oh, thank you, Mariana. Oh, Margie. <laughs> That's me too. Every time I turn around, there it is. <laughs> Yay, Barbara, that's amazing. You lost 50 pounds. That's amazing. Congratulations. <laughs> All right, where are we here? We have a few things left. I'm saving that. That's going to go in the other. Oh, here we go. Voyage extraordinaire let's put that on here get your steampunk box this kit will ship on June the 15th you don't want to miss out on this because once they're gone they're gone all right let's see what we can put over here Here's a little feather, just for the fun of it, maybe. I did glue that there, so I'm going to stamp the word journal at the top. I don't want it to be too thick, but it's getting thicker at the top because I haven't put a lot of stuff at the bottom. <laughs> oh, yeah. Breads, biscuits, all of those things. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. I, I'm really glad you say so. Thank you so much, Regina. That's so sweet of you. All right, I think what I'll do is I got another one of these. Let's trim that. And we'll make a little tuck spot at the bottom. Group hug. Lots of love. All right, let's see here. I think that'll work. I want a little tuck spot here at the bottom. I've got another little journal card I want to add. So let's see, how does that look? Does it need a little bit more color maybe? You know, I'm going to do something that I haven't done in a while. I'm going to get some acrylic paint here. I'm going to shake it up. This is cheaper than Dr. Phil, right? <laughs> You know, I, I'll tell you, the key to losing weight is to move. Get up and move. Figure out whatever exercise that works for you and move. Um, because there's really no other way to get around losing weight. If you don't move, you can't get rid of it. You know, you just can't get it to go anywhere because it sits right there where you sit. And... You can find all kinds of things that you can do, whether it be yoga or go for a walk, anything like that. Those are beautiful. Thank you. All right, so I'm going to dry this. So I just add a little bit of acrylic paint to the edges because I thought it would look better behind that yellow. So this is another way that if you have a piece of paper that's not the right color, get off some acrylic paint. Just paint it have to we need to we need to stay healthy how else are we going to live long enough to use all these craft supplies <laughs> i think i'll have to live to be a hundred to use them all oh yeah i like that better i like that teal i think that'll be good all right Walking, you know, sometimes you just got to find a, a pretty place to go, a park, or find a friend that'll go with you. Whatever doesn't make your, you know what, I'll tell you something, Julie, that um, I, I believe that if you exercise properly, your knee would feel better. Um, Henry has knee issues, and he's learning how to strengthen it so it's better. But yeah, find what works for you and do it for your health so you can craft for a long time.
You used to love going for a walk. And maybe, you know, you need to get a, you know, a bicycle, you know. Um, I like using the rowing machine at our gym. I think, yeah, let's do that. Let's just add this up here. This is one of the nib rubber stamps. And it's been, it's got gently sprayed with some tattered angels on there. All right, let's put a little journaling card in here. And I think, has any, did anybody see the picture of Hercules on my uh, page? He got a new haircut. He has a mohawk. <laughs> he has a mohawk now. All right, I don't want to put that down in there too far. Stamp that there. Let's add... Can we do oh let's add this guy over here and maybe we'll add some other stamps as well knee issues those are yeah knee, do knee strengthening like for sure because it's it's better for you if you can you like that it's cute you saw Herc. <laughs> he looked handsome. Thank you. <laughs> uh, that beard is so, that beard just comes out and it's just growing and growing. Somebody asked me, how do you keep it clean? I said, well, he's usually pretty good. Uh, we don't give him a lot of wet food, so he doesn't really get his beard down in it. And usually after he mashes it down, uh, it's not so bad. Okay, I think this one is called... Um, Oh my gosh, what is the flower called? Uh, it's called Composed, I think. Compose. Composed. I think that's right. It's one of those. Let me see. Yep, it is. I am so good. Composed. That's what this rubber stamp is. Composed. And I think it's just pretty, you know. Um, versatile if you will because you can use it on many different things yeah little Fu Manchu <laughs> um, let's do this I'm going to stamp this across the top here what kind of kind of looks like we did some stitches on there Kind of cool, huh? That was shabby stitches. Alrighty, so let's see here. What can we put on this side? We did the shabby stitches there. So let's do the gears. Kind of rotate them around. Kind of fill up the page with some gears. And then let's go over here on this side. I got a little butterfly. Actually, what I'm going to do is stamp the butterfly directly onto the page a couple of times. I think I'm going to go here and then like that. So I think we could do butterflies with it. Yeah. Oh, ouch, ouch, ouch. Well, you got to take care of yourself now. Alrighty, let's see. Let's put that guy there. I think we're almost done with this front part of the journal. Has everybody entered the raffle? Did you enter the raffle for the stamps? Okay, so we did this side. So let's kind of go back this way. This is going to go right there. Kind of reminds me of Hercules. <laughs> oh no! Well, I'm glad you're back. Enter the raffle. Butterflies match everything, Robin says. I agree. All right, so now I'm going in the opposite direction. Here's our little tuck spot here. Let's see what we've got over here. People are sending me messages. <laughs> 
Oh, I'll get them when I'm done. All right, and this one, let's see. What do we want to put over here? Is it time for me to do the raffle? Remind me. Okay, let's put the car down here. Got to take care of yourselves for sure. I'll put the little car down there. And let's put the, a different car on the other side. How's that sound? We want variety. Variety, I tell you. Let's do this. Kind of adding a little bit. I'm going to add kind of off the edge. Really faint. I'm not stamping it really hard. So it just kind of gives a little bit of texture. Yes, raffle time! Okay, let me stamp this. Okay, so we've got one, two, three, four. Okay, we got four pages that we need to do. So I'm going to do the raffle. Raffle, I'm going to get a drink. Thank you, Kay. Raffle, 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 a ruffle, or it will be a raffle, a ruffle, raffle. <laughs> All righty, let's see the giveaway. Let me get my notepad. I need some new pens. My pens are running out of ink. All right, are y'all ready? <laughs> oh, yeah, there's going to be so many cool things in the retreat. It's got a fun. <laughs> All right. Let's do pick a winner for the rubber stamp sets. The or the clear stamp sets. The winner is Julie Parker. Congratulations, Julie. Congratulations, Julie. You won the stamps. All right. So now let's see. Let's do 200 junk bucks. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. Reset. All right. I will give... Lynn, you're going to get 200 junk bucks because I hit the button by mistake. All right. You were in the enter. Okay, so now we're going to clear that and we're going to do 200 junk bucks bucks so this will be the next giveaway so you got a bonus giveaway lynn <laughs> woohoo you won congratulations and lynn won some junk bucks so we enter the raffle now for some junk bucks and let's finish decorating this journal let's see here i think oh thank you christy for your donation I don't know where we are on that. Let me check the donations. Let's see what it says. 50, 60, we, we're uh, about $62 so far for the donations. So thank you, thank you, thank you, everyone. Thank you. I greatly appreciate it. Enter the raffle. Yes, I still have your address, Julie. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. I have your address. Alright, so I'm going to cut. I'm cutting a piece of craft paper to fit behind this little fussy cut element. And so we're going to stamp the gears all over it. Norella, are you working? Oh, Sonia, don't take it out on poor Junky Joe. <laughs> he doesn't know any better. <laughs> oh, dear. All right. I love how this gear stamp works. Because you can just stamp it over and over and over. All right, we're going to put this on here. And that will be a little text box. I don't have time to cook. That's right. I'm thankful that Henry 
it cooks for me. <laughs> or we have to order food, but no carbs. You're still in your dressing gown, Julie? Aren't you supposed to be getting ready for work, little lady? <laughs> Don't be late to work, okay? <laughs> <gasps> oh, it's okay, Sonya. Did you get your stamps yet? I know I sent you some stamps. Did you get your last order, Sonya? Have you played with your stamps yet? What have you been doing, lady? Right, we're going to put this down here. Chunky Joe is evil. He gave you 22 points? <laughs> no, it's Tuesday. Okay, I couldn't remember what if, if it was Tuesday that you were day off. I know that you come on Thursday for a little bit, and I think that's when you have to go to work. I like this. Did y'all notice that this little card, it has the months on here, okay? And then it has the day, so you, or the numbers of the month. So you can write the year, you can circle what month it is, Circle what day it is, and then you can write your little note. Today you did. Okay, awesome. I'm glad you got them. Ah, you only work on Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. Gotcha. You're entering stuff. Gotcha. You're doing, you're working on the retreat. Penny's got their whip going. Go! Go! Hey, Diana. So glad to have you here. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Enter the raffle. If you just got here, enter the raffle. I'm giving away 200 junk bucks so that you can purchase things from my shop. Once you get to 2,000 junk bucks, you get a $10 off coupon. All right, I think that'll go there. All right, and I got a little piece of paper here, and is this big enough? Yes. I like adding these whenever I can. I'm going to go ahead and cut both of these so it's ready in case I want it later. And then I'll find it on my desk later and I'm like, oh, that's where that went. <laughs> Nothing goes to waste. We always find a place for it. All right, so let's add some little gears right across the top there. And then we'll do the word journal. And I've got a little butterfly. We'll stick that in there. Oh, Christy! Um... I found out why you didn't get your journal. It was accidentally shipped to somebody else. And thankfully, she's such a sweet, sweet lady. Uh, she mailed it back to me. Thank you, Janice, for doing that. <laughs> and I knew you have a couple orders with me, so it's going to go in your order. So that's why you hadn't gotten your journal yet. And Robin hadn't got hers yet because I'm putting a whole bunch of goodies together for her. Because she's been doing some work for me. So I want to I want to compensate her for what she's done, <laughs> like being here and helping me. You're gonna add extra carbs to their units. <laughs> Feels like five degrees. That's cold. It's winter time, isn't it, in Australia? Down under, it's a little bit chilly. Alrighty, let's see here. I don't think I want to stamp the shabby stitches again. Shabby stitches on my page. Yes, I'm deliberately stamping them at weird angles because it kind of gives a, an unusual thing, I think. And let's add a little flower in the corner there. Make Robin wait! <laughs> <laughs> yes, the beginning of winter. Okay, I thought it was. You would have kept that journal, Mariana? <laughs> well, I'm I'm very blessed with some good followers that she saw my error and sent it back. So I am grateful for that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Did y'all enter the raffle? 
You like how I did that? Just kind of add the shabby stitches around. Um, let's do the word. We stamped it on that, so we'll just stamp it directly onto the page on this side. Okay. There we go. This, it's starting to get fluffy with all the things in it. I'm liking it. I hope you're liking it too. I always have fun making these journals. I hope you enjoy watching. Oh, to sending her one of my journals. Oh. That stitch, that's the zigzag stitch from the shabby stitches, Julie. All right, we'll do that on top of there. You can't wait, can't, Terry. You excited about the steampunk kit? I think you'll have fun with it. I do. I love it. I'm having a lot of fun. Those are shabby stitches. It's called the. It's it's. Well, I guess it's kind of a zipper stitch. It's. It looks like a zipper stitch, but it's a it's a sewing stitch. It's not the zigzag. It's one of my favorites. I got a little gear here. Let's put that gear up there. Fluffy journal. And remember with this, you're getting three journals. You're getting three inserts as a part of the cover. Of course, if y'all don't donate enough money, then I don't have to make a new journal for myself. This one will be mine. <laughs> I'll keep it. <laughs> All righty, let's see here. Well, I've got this little guy. He might look kind of pretty down here on the page. Oh, you could have bought a, a stamp instead of a sewing machine. <laughs> well, you can still get the stamp set, Barbara, for when you want to, you know, take your kit with you to work on it and you don't want to haul your sewing machine or you don't have electricity see you could still do that <laughs> all righty um let's see here shabby stitches i'm gonna do it again i like it it's fun kind of did it a little bit straighter then all right Oh, no. Well, Marie, you if you are donating through YouTube, you have to have a payment form set up through Super Chat. And if you want, you could try using the Streamlabs um, to make a donation. So, Stream. Let me do that. Stream. So there's the Streamlab link that Junkie Joe's going to post. All right, so here's the journal that I just finished decorating. So here's the front cover. There's pages. We decorated with stitches. So there's lots of writing space. That's what I wanted. And I'm forcing it upon you because that's what I wanted. <laughs> Thank you, Jenny, for your donation. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay. You liking it? Thank you, thank you, thank you. You went to Vivid last night? Oh, there you go, Barbara. Come go. Come see me. Come see me. Love to have you. I've already had one gal from Arkansas send me a message that she was in Oklahoma because she has family here and I got to meet her. She even came to my house. So she saw this mess. <laughs> you like it? The junkie jar needs $40 for this amazing journal today, Robin says. You like the picked up Hercules the best? <laughs> You would fill it with pockets and tags and ATCs. Thank you, Barbara. Well, you could. You could do that, Margie. Let me sign it. Let me sign this one.
All right, so that one is done. And we're going to put it inside the cover. All right, so we're going to stick this in here. So this is a Midori style cover that I've made. And let's go ahead and decorate the front cover. But let me see, how long has it been since I did the last giveaway? Are we good? Do we need to do another one? Oh. You go to Honduras on mission trips, but I'm not going to New York too busy and had to go to Hawaii to visit my daughter. Ooh, wonderful in the service. Thank her for serving. And basically, if it ain't connected to Georgia, I ain't going. <laughs> I understand. I understand. Uh, time. Is it time? Okay. Well, then we will do that. I'm looking at this. I'm trying to decide how I want to put this together. What else do we got here? Do we have any cool things that we want to use. Ooh, we could do flying ships. Steampunk. What else does that need? What else? What else? What else? Oh, we could do the clock. Oh, thank you, Marie. You got it. Yay! You got it to work. <laughs> thank you for your donation. Alrighty. So, Raffle! We are live! We are live! This is live right now! Of course, whenever someone is watching the replay, they're going to think it's live. So, <laughs> it's June the 3rd, and it is 5.27 p.m. Central Standard Time. We are live. <laughs> Alright, I think I like that. You said a kitty? I don't know if I have a kitty left, Margie. Let me look. Let me see if I have a kitty. I don't think I do. Oh, but I got this pen. What do you think? Kind of doing a little collage. Do we want to put that here? I don't know. I'm, I'm looking at that. Do we like that? Is that looking okay? It needs something else, I think, though. So we're going to let that sit for a moment. Gears! That's what we need. I've got this gear, and I've got that gear. How's that? Are we getting there? For those of you that didn't know, that cover is fabric. And what I did was I took some of my mixed media prints and scanned it into my computer. And then I laid it out into a full cover and had my husband print it on our direct to garment printer. And that's how I came up with this. And then I stitched around it. Thank you, Janice, for your donation. Remember, those of you are donating today, then you can, um, let's do it. You should sit at an angle. Okay. You also get a free digital downloads from my shop and you get a discount. You just need to create an account on my website. And once you do that, send me a message to the contact me with your YouTube name and the email address that you use to create an account. And I can get you added so that you can get the free digital downloads and you get discount on items in my shop. All right, we're getting there. I don't know if I want that gear under there. Maybe like that. Maybe we'll put this one up there. I think that looks better. Okay, we're getting there. We're getting there. You'll add lots of kitties. <laughs> Pin under steampunk. So you and we we're asking to put it at a diagonal. So I, I was kind of looking at that. All right, so let's do the next drawing for the 200 junk bucks. All right. Giveaway! We're going to do the giveaway! It worked, Marie! Good job! Like an underline, so you think like that. Okay. I haven't glued anything down yet. <laughs> thank you, Kathy, for your donation. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, we're getting closer. All right, giveaway. 
Has everybody entered? Everybody entered the raffle? All right, giveaway. Pick winner. Lynn Wheeler! <laughs> That's hilarious. Okay. 200 junk bucks. All right, Lynn, you want 200 junk bucks? All right, I'm going to do another one. So, you ready? Did y'all enter the raffle? Mm. Lynn, congratulations, Lynn. I'm going to do one more winner. Why not? We're going to pick another. I'm in a generous mood today. So, the next junk buck winner is Christy. Christy Johnson. Congratulations, Christy. All right, so we're going to reset that. And let's do, let's see what I've gotten. Let's, let's look in Linda's goodie bag here. <laughs> oh, good. I got some more of these. Okay. I got some more of those stickers. Okay, the video stickers. So one of them has like, um, just a, a globe, like a travel globe, and suitcases. And then this is a pineapple and flamingo. So we're going to do these stickers. All right. So we're going to say a video sticker. All right. Open giveaway. Okay. All righty. Any, any changes that I need to make here? I think this looks pretty good, don't you? Oh, I could add. Let's do that. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Let's see how this looks. I don't embellish my covers very much because I don't like them um, too dimensional. But I think that would look kind of cute. What do you think? Do you like that? Maybe it should go here. Steampunk journal. Yes, maybe, no? I did not say Hercules' new honorary title. <laughs> um, Sonia was telling me that her little Yorkie girl is going to have babies, and so Hercules is now hunk Uncle Hercules. <laughs> All right. Looks great, Mariana says. Thank you. All right, so here's what we got to do. We got to build from the back. So I'm going to glue this piece together so it doesn't fall apart on me. And how many of y'all, when you're doing a design like this, um, that you'll grab your cell phone, which I can't seem to find at the moment. Oh, here it is. Grab your cell phone. Yes, the steampunk word. Okay. And then uh, take a picture of it so you kind of know how things go back together if you undo it <laughs> so i took a picture of it so now it's on my cell phone so now i know what it looks like for some reason bixby wants to talk to me and i don't care all right so now we've got that so we're going to stick down the ship and then we'll put the word steampunk on top of it you like it uncle hercules <laughs> She would be his little sister because she's tiny. She weighs like three pounds, Sonia said. And Hercules weighs about nine. You never thought of it to take a picture? That's a great way, though, to know if you've got everything. And also, you can check your composition, see how it looks in the photo. Because sometimes looking at it this way is completely different. I don't know why, but when you look at a photo, you can kind of see, oh, well, something sticks out. It doesn't match. It doesn't go together. And then you can change it up. So when I click donate, it goes to a place with name, nickname, amount, USD, some, just, but the donate button won't highlight to push. So Linda, it's possible that you don't have the um a payment form connected to your account so basically you just have to figure out and i can't tell you because i'm trying to do this but <laughs> there's a way to connect a payment 
You knew Bill Bixby? <laughs> You love that idea, Julie? It's just a great way to figure things out, I think. So I think I want this guy. We're going to put flying ships here. Okay. So I'm going to glue this guy down. And then we're going to put that across here. Like that. Is it straight? I think it's straight. You have three-month-old puppies that weigh more than that? <laughs> I bet, Sherry. Uh, well, about five pounds all of a sudden. Well, because she's going to have babies. Going to have babies. Hopefully, she just has one, maybe two. I can imagine a dog that small having very many puppies at one time. When we used to raise Pomeranians, they might have three at the very most. But usually it was two puppies that they would have. Okay, you liking that? All right, we're going to put the steampunk down. I think I want to move it down just slightly so you can see the bottom of the basket just a little bit. Okay. Your, yes, it's flying ships. What did you think it said? Because <laughs> I was, there's the balloon, so I was thinking flying ships right beside it. So we're going to put that there and put that one there. Alrighty. So we have one more journal to decorate. Okay, you like that? So I'm going to show you the second journal that is in here. This one I've already decorated. So I use the, from the um, printed kit, it has this label and it says Calco Collage up here. I cut it apart and used one of the uh, bee designs and I put a little heart over the journal, the kit. So it says Punked Out Steam and I made a pocket in the front of this journal. And inside that, I did some stamping and I added one of my gel prints and another rubber stamp that I colored. And that's right here on the inside cover. And then we have the wannabe Hercules. Yeah, if we don't hit it, I get to keep it. Now there, there's your kitty cat, Margie. There's your kitty cat. Um, here's another gel print. This is one of my mixed media prints that I scanned into my computer. If you notice, I also used it here as a pocket. So I had leftovers, so I used it there. How do I not save everything? Question for the chat, she says. How do I not save everything? Yeah, some of us still do. This was using that uh, stained glass with the different colors of Tattered Angels. I love the way that looks because it does look like stained glass. Does it not? Does it not look like stained glass? De-stash. I don't de-stash enough. I don't take the time. <laughs> it, it takes work. <laughs> you love the color? Thank you. Thank you so much. Another the rubber stamps there. Um, this is the top part off of a tag that I didn't like because it was way too long. So let me see if I still have one. No, I don't. It's in here somewhere. So I added it to another journal card. So you kind of see there's a difference there. And then I use the spinning flowers with Tattered Angels and stamped and added the Paris. And then this is another altered paper clip. Love the color. More stamping. The pages from the printed kit. Here's another little journal card I made. A little tuck spot. Hey, Ada, so glad you're here. This is the second journal. So I'm going to show you the third journal. We're going to get that finished. This is another one of my gel prints that I scanned in and then I printed it. And I used it in a different journal. And this was a piece left over, so I thought it would be a good journal card. Yeah, friends give me things too. I have too many things. It's another little pocket. Oh, 
I love this center page. So this is notebook paper that I sprayed with Tattered Angels Glimmer Mist. And then I stamped it. And then these are all just scraps that I have here. Hey, Peggy. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Got to keep everything. <laughs> it is hard to purge. You got to take time to do it. You like in this journal? This is a little envelope that comes in the kit, the printed kit. It has these little journal cards in it. There's another kitty cat, Margie. Put that in that pocket there. I love the spinning flowers with the multicolors. Another kitty cat, Margie. Journaling card over here. I didn't make this a tuck spot, but I just thought it looked kind of cool on that page. Yeah, you find something you forgot about three hours later. Yeah, you like the center page? Thank you, Kathy. Thank you so much. Rusty metals. And I stamped the gears on top of the gears. Lots of texture, if you will. We love the journal. Thank you. Yeah, I forgot about the distache event in the, F, the Friendly Junk Journal people. Here's where I cut off the top of that tag. And I just realized I didn't add any distress ink. I didn't want the tag sticking out of the journal. So that's why I cut it off. But I do have a couple of more tags here. So we're going to put one in the pocket so it'll stay within and one here. So let's work on the third journal. Okay. Yeah, the pretty kit's cool, isn't it, Margie? I love it. I love how it's come together. So here's another one of the printed kit journal pages, or journals. So that's the cover. Here's one of the fussy cut items that I put on the inside. And I started decorating it, but I was running out of time. So I've got a few pages that I've already done. Here is the center page of this journal. So this time I put some notebook paper up here. I put a mixed media piece in the middle. These were part of that, uh, and it didn't glue, I need more glue, uh, of the cover page for the printed kit. And I cut up all the pieces and then I backed them onto another journaling card and sticking that down. Why aren't you gluing? Am I not getting any glue on here? That must be why. You got to get glue on it if you want it to stick. Okay. And then that will go up here. And this one will go right here. This paper is shiny because it's laser printed. Thank you so much, Carrie Ann. All right. I did not put little um, hearts on this. So let me grab some hearts and we'll put some hearts on there. All right. Y'all get some of my DNA. <laughs> All righty. So we're going to take the string and put it into the glue. And I'm going to get another heart and stick that on top. I have paint on me. I have Tattered Angels Glimmer Mist on me. My fingers are dirty. Aw, thank you, Ada, for your donation. More stuff. All right, we'll put that there. Thank you, Sherry, for your donation. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We're getting closer. I may not get to keep this journal. <laughs> they cost an arm and a leg for sure. <laughs> Free DNA. Woohoo! <laughs> you get a little touch of me in here. <laughs> don't use this journal to murder somebody. I don't want to be implicated. <laughs> oh, dear. Okay. 
let's kind of look to see. All right, that page doesn't have anything, so let's decorate it. Let's decorate it. You like that? Okay. Oh, here's another kitty. Let's see if we can put him on something. Let's grab. I think I want some color. Maybe we should do this instead. I think he would look cute on that pink. So let's trim that to a smaller piece. Uh, personally, I have a inkjet printer and I have a laser printer. They are both by Hewlett Packard. The journal kits are professionally printed by a local printer guy and he has a I don't remember if it was Kodak or Minolta. He's got a super duper heavy duty kit one. Isn't that cute? Cute kitty. Welcome, Nancy. Glad to have you here. Put that right here. And then let's add some distress inks to the edges. Yeah, it's exactly. Whenever you're shopping for a printer, before you commit, find out how much it costs for the supplies. Because my laser printer is over $400 to buy new cartridges. I tried buying a different brand or a remanufactured cartridge that wasn't by Hewlett Packard, and I was not happy with the... Uh, way it printed. It was terrible. But I like my little HP inkjet printer. It seems to have beautiful images. This was printed on my inkjet printer. And I just love the way it's turned out. I think we'll put that right there. Okay. We have rusty metals. Kitty, so cute. Yorkie representation. I gotta find another one. There's one in there. I just gotta find another. Put a little scrap of paper here. And then we'll put the rusty metals on top. Is everybody entered in the raffle? I don't know when I need to do it again. Robin will remind me. All right, we'll put that right here. I keep sliding this way. I, I keep piling stuff up in front of me. <laughs> I was watching Penny on her uh, journal or live journal, and it was only big enough for a notebook and not even her little work surface. It was so full of things, and mine's shrinking down to that. <laughs> yeah, you can save on ink by buying the refurbished cartridges. I agree. Sometimes they're not worth the money you pay for them. That happened to me. Let's see here. This page has a lot on it. Uh, maybe we won't use it. You know, sometimes I don't use everything in the kit. Sometimes I kind of play around with things and decide that I don't need to use everything in the kit. What else we got here? Ooh, this guy's kind of cute. Maybe we'll put him on there. <clears throat> okay, thank you, Robin. She keeps me going. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We'll put this right here. And then that'll be a tuck spot. Yeah, exactly, exactly. Sonia says, you know, always check for the the uh, toner of or ink for your printers, but also find out if they require other things to be uh, used with them. Let's put that right there. A little. This is the the small pen nib. Okay, now it's going to be stuck to my table. Come on. Ah, I put more glue on it now. <laughs> I 
I tried to glue it to my table, y'all. Alright, now I had a whole bunch of little things that said journal. Where'd they go, y'all? Did I use them all? I don't remember. Oh, here's one. Got one! Alright, let's add some distress inks to it. Okay, one minute till the, this is the last free raffle, and then I, if I have enough money, we'll raffle off the journal. I think we're really close. Let's see where we are on that. I'll refresh. So 60, 70. So we're at seventy-three dollars and ninety-five cents, or about twenty-something dollars shy of raffling off the journal today. About less than 20, 20, 23, 24 dollars. We're really close. I may end up keeping it. Okay, let's put that there. This is one of the envelopes that comes in the subscription box and it's printed on the inside and then you have these little two journal cards and they're printed on the back side. Okay, thirty dollars and four cents, and I'll, I'll even do it at twenty-five. If there's twenty-five dollars that are donated, is the small nib a niblet? <laughs> I guess you could call it a niblet. <laughs> My math, I know. Sorry, I don't do math very well. <laughs> I went to public schools. All right, let's put this guy here. Let's put the shabby stitches across the page. See you later, Jenny. All right, Jenny. Thanks for stopping in. Yeah, you like the heavier paper, Janice? It's good to have that heavier paper. Oh, thank you, Christy, for your donation. Uh, don't keep this one. <laughs> oh, put that across there. I'm liking it. All right. What can we put? Oh, yeah. Let's do this. Clockwork. If it gets closer, Margie says she will. <laughs> I got it right side up. Since it's got clockworks, let's put clockworks. You like the swaps, Bonnie? I'm glad. I'm so glad you like those swaps. We try to make them fun. Uh, Robin is our swap coordinator, so she's really good at coordinating those swaps and following up with people and making sure that they sent their stuff. Thank you, Carrie Ann, for your donation. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, let's put the word, let's stamp the word journal over here. I think I got it upside down. We'll add a little couple of butterflies. And then let's do the shabby stitches. So it kind of gives little segments. Shabby stitches. Thank you, Mary Jones, for your donation. Thank you, Robin, for your donation. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Y'all not going to let me keep this journal, are you? <laughs> you know, I'm not real sure, Julie. Um, you may just have to do a Google search to find out. As far as G GSM on your paper. Got the little guy there. All right, so let's see. What can we put? I think we need a pocket. We need a pocket. Let's see what we got going on here. <laughs> what do I want? Oh, I know what I can do. I've got some more of these pieces. I've got this pink piece. 
So let's cut that to be a pocket and grow across there. Nope, Robinson. <laughs> Cheaper to replace the printer. Not today. <laughs> Dang it. I don't get to keep any of my journals. <laughs> That's why I've been working on one when I know it wasn't for a stream. I've got a, a little baggie down here. I don't know where I put it at the moment, but I've got a little baggie of stuff. I've been cutting out things and getting it all ready so I can make a journal for myself. Oh, I think this would look good right on top of there. Yeah, let's do that. Thank you, Barbara, for your donation. Thank you, thank you. <sighs> My Chinese fun. We did have Chinese food um, Saturday night. Henry and I kind of have a, a date night, if you will. Um, I know it may sound weird, but we have casinos here in Oklahoma, and if you go, even if you just spend a few dollars, they will send you a, um, a postcard inviting you to come back, and they usually have some free money. So, we went, and on Saturday, I had to remember where we were, we went to... No, it was Friday night. Friday night we went to Riverwind here in Oklahoma, and it was late, but and I was hungry, so we went ahead and ate dinner while we were walking around and looking, and we had Panda Express, <laughs> and I had um, walnut shrimp. Those are pretty good. I don't eat the rice and whatnot. I eat the shrimp pretty much, and it was really tasty, and then we got free money um, because it was a special, it was the last day of the month, I had $15 in free money, and we walked away with $100 that we had won from the casino. We didn't put any money in the machine. Thank you so much, Amanda. I love nights like that. <laughs> I love it. All right, let's see. I've got some journal cards here. I'm trying to see what I want to put in there. I think I'm going to cut apart this belly band because it's too big and I'm not going to use it. Do I hear 15? It's great. <laughs> we have fun. We, we like going. We'll, we find our games that we enjoy and we go for it as entertainment. So instead of going to the movie theater, we'll go to the casino with whatever money we would have spent at... Um, the movie theater will spend on gambling and I try to find machines that entertain me. It has to be entertaining. One of them that we like is called Planet Moolah <laughs> and it's a lot of fun. <sighs> Laugh raffle time. Thank you, Mary. for Oh, thank you so much for your donation, Mary. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, so Robin's telling me it's raffle time. Let's see, what did I put on this side? Okay, so we put that there. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm adding some of those. All right, we're gonna go the raff, the last free raffle. It's coming right up. So if you haven't joined the raffle, please do so now. Raffle. Thank you so much, Nancy, for your donation. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, dear. No casino. <laughs> Linda's getting my Chinese food. Thank you, Margie. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. The rifle mount has been met. Woohoo! All right. So I'm going to flip over to the page that I need to decorate next. We're going to do the raffle, the last free raffle. And we're going to start the last raffle for the journal, okay? Yay! <laughs> no journal for you, Miss Linda. <laughs> well, thank you, thank you, thank you. I greatly appreciate it. <laughs> I don't get to keep it this time. Dang it! <laughs> oh, 
my goodness. Too funny. Y'all crack me up. All right, let's see who's going to win the video stickers. All right, y'all ready? And the winner is Sherry Deskins. You won the video stickers. I have your address, so we're good to go on that. Congratulations, Sherry. All right, I'm making my notes. All right, we're going to reset and click OK. All right, so those that are going to enter now, this is for the punked, if I can type it, punked out steam JJ. All right, so only those who have donated are eligible to win the journal. And so we have Felique or Margie. We have Nancy, Mary, Terry, Amanda, Barbara, Oliver, Robin, Mary, Carrie Ann, Christy, Sherry, Ada, Kathy, Janice, Mar Marie Duncan, Jenny, Christy again, Christy again, thank you so much. Jenny again, thank you. Deborah, Vic, uh, Lynn subscribed, so she's not available. Okay, Terry, Kay Andal, Lynn Wheeler, and Margie again. Thank you again, Margie. And Mariana and Regina and Christy and Janice and Christy Clover and Carrie Ann again. Thank you. And Christy Johnson again. Thank you. Sherry Deskins and Annika and Robin Finnessy again. Thank you. And Barbara Daly Gotcha Wolf and Crazy Lady, aka Sonia. <laughs> You're very welcome. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Alrighty, so let's finish this journal, and once I get it done, we'll do the last raffle, alright? So, what do I want to put on this page? Now, if you want a chance to win this journal, there's still time. Before I say last call, you can make a donation of any dollar amount, and then make sure you type exclamation point raffle, okay? Alrighty, let me get a drink of water. You like all the mess I got on my table? <laughs> so now is the time to enter the raffle. I think, I think that looks kind of pretty. And I think that's all it needs on that page. Let's just put the flower down here in the corner. This is another one of those fussy cut things. Did y'all see my uh, mixed media where I did the gelatos last Thursday? Did y'all like that? What would you like for me to do this Thursday for our mixed media project? Do you want me to do gel printing? Or do you want me just to do the direct to paper uh, mixed media where I use the stencils directly on the papers? Let me know what you want to do. What you want to see. Okay. Got a few little journal cards and thingies here. All right. I think I'm going to stamp the gears up there. Yes, indeed. Did you like that, Mary? I had fun making those gelato pages. There were a lot of neat colors that came up in those. You like the gelatos? You want to do you want me to do the gel printing, Bonnie? A bit of both. I see gel twice now. I see gel printing three times. You totally miss it. You need to go see it. Stencils and inks. All of it. <laughs> A little bit of everything. I think that would look cute across there. Margie, just make stuff. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I make a little bit of everything. A little bit of everything. Gel printing. I see gel printing. I think that's going to win. I think gel printing is going to win. Let's see here. Let's put a pocket on this side. So what do we got here? I have this piece. So let's trim that to fit. Robin says, I vote stuff. <laughs> Just make stuff. I can do that. 
Mm. Well, I hope you're enjoying this. I hope you're inspired to create and that you are making things. Don't just buy the stuff and let it sit there in the box, y'all. Get it out. Play with it. Make something. Have fun with it. I think we'll do that. Oh, there's a right side and a wrong side to this. Which way does it go? Okay, it's got a flower on it. Okay. Gears. I think I have another gear here somewhere. Let me see. Or, I know what I can do. I can stamp on this. So that's what we'll do. We'll put this here. And then we'll stamp the gears. <laughs> Thank you, Margie. I second the motion for stuff. <laughs> so I get to do whatever I want. Is that what you're trying to tell me? <sighs> we love you too, Margie. Thank you, thank you. All right, I think that would be kind of cute as a pocket. Yeah? I don't know when I started saying yeah. <laughs> I guess I've been listening to too many Canadians. <laughs> All right, we'll add the gears word. I see that right about there. Like that. Oh, gee, y'all, y'all crack me up. Motion for stuff. Alrighty, I gotta do coupon codes when I get off here after I eat some dinner with my hubby. I've gotta award the junk bucks to a few people. Alrighty. Let's put... This one has a diagram. I don't know if you can see of the horse on there. That's kind of cool. It's faded in the background. A lot of love going on around here. Your bug love, love, big love fest. I'm so glad, you know. That's what we should be. We should be, in, you know, encouraging each other, lifting each other up. Never tear anybody down. There's a campaign that's been going on uh, Facebook about... Um, basically stop the negativity or the cyberbullying on YouTube. You know, if you can't say not, something nice, don't say anything at all. Thank you so much, Robin. Yeah, I did put a lot of time in this before the live. I don't know if y'all know that um, a lot of people say, how long does it take you to make a journal? Well, you know, you got to think up the idea, and then I've got to make the product or find the product that I'm going to use. And then we have to get everything ready, like fussy cutting items and inking the edges and finding all the pieces and putting it together. And so I may spend a day to two days getting everything ready for a live stream. All right. Is that what I want? Let's see here. This is the, I think we're at the last page. Nope, I got two more pages to decorate. I got this one in the other side. <clears throat> so we're getting close to ending here. Much love. Love this journal of mine, Christy says. <laughs> oh, dear. Yeah, it does. Getting everything ready takes the longest. And that's why when I tell people when you get the kit, first thing you need to do is fussy cut everything. Get it all ready. Um, and then that way when it's time to put it together, you can just make a pile and just start grabbing things from that pile to put in the journal. I don't know that I like that. Let me see here. Oh, that's just a scrap. I think we'll just do that little scrap. Why not? It was laying here on my desk. I'll put it to use. Crosses my spirit toes, Christy says, so she can hopefully win the journal. I think. I 
and then we'll put that right in the middle so you kind of get a, a halo effect wait margie says someone's claiming my journal <laughs> oh dear All right, so there's this page. Claim it, lady. <laughs> All right, we're going to stamp the word journal on this side. And let's do the truck down here in the corner. Claim it. Go away, Marge. It's mine, Mariana says. <laughs> well, good luck, everybody. We're getting ready. We're getting ready. All right, I got to do something on this page. I think, I know I have, here we go. I got a spiral paper clip. So we're going to put a spiral paper clip on here to hold this little mixed media card that I made. There we go. Like that. And then let's stamp the word journal up here. Okay. Last page. Junky Joe is evil. Oh, what happened to all the love, right, Margie? <laughs> Everybody's like, pick me, pick me. It's all about me. All righty. I've got this little guy. What do we have here? That looks kind of interesting, doesn't it? With a little color there. So let's glue that together. <laughs> All right, so let's put this right here. Got everybody laying claim, laying claim. I like this bright colors. Bright colors just make me happy. Uh, all right, we're gonna do this and this. All right, last call to get entered into the raffle. If you haven't donated and you want a chance to win, now's your chance. But it's mine. <clears throat> How close are you, uh, Julie? Are you pretty close to getting your junk bucks? <clears throat> Let's put this guy in here. All righty. Popular journal, for sure. All right, we're going to clean this out of the way. Move this out of the way. Move this out of the way. Let's get, get some clear, clear the space, y'all. Clear the space. Last call. Put my scissors away. I got to clean my desk off because I'll be live tomorrow during the retreat. We need to put something in that pocket. Let's see here what we got. What do we got here? Here we go. We'll put this little card in here. That yellow on the yellow. I think that looks good. And here's this page. So I'm just going to quickly flip through it. You love the owl. Any fun? I like how that turned out. That's kind of cool. Stamping the butterfly on there. Flip through time. Journal cards that go in the pockets here. I love this stencil. That's the flower tile stencil. Just in case. Good luck, everybody. Cross his fingers and toes, Robin says. I love this page, too, the way it turned out for the center. We've got the little flower, or the hearts, I mean, here. Oh, it got, it got wonky. That's okay. It's handmade. It's okay. I like it that way. Okay. 
Yeah, the, yeah with the, all the love goes out the door when the journal raffle happens. I like that this came out too, just doing the stamping across there. Kind of fun. Journal extraordinaire, voyage extraordinaire. Clockwork. But don't we all love the journal? Eh. All right. Henry should be home shortly so we can eat some dinner. All righty, so let me put that in the cover. I didn't sign it. I need to do that. There's my pen. Sign this one. Okay. Everyone loves the journal. <laughs> Ada says, I have to go cook, but I can send you my address. <laughs> All right, let me sign this one. I'm going to sign it up the spine here. All righty. And let me sign the inside cover. All righty. There's the journal, y'all. Look at that. Look at that fluffiness. Look at that fluffiness. Ah. We still love each other. That's right. All right. Well, let's do the drawing. It's time now. It is time to draw. Do y'all have any questions? Is there anything else that y'all need or have questions about? Do feel free to ask. I love this page. I like whining. <laughs> well, it'll fall upon deaf ears because I don't put up with whining. <laughs> you like red wine? <laughs> All right, let's pick the winner. Get my notepad. And my pen. All right, who's going to win the journal today? All righty, pick a winner. Manda Dawn. You won, Manda. Thank you so much, Manda. I think I have your address journal. I mean, address, uh, Manda. Um, I was writing down journals. That's why I said it. Um, but just in case, make sure... That you send me a message, Manda. Are you still here? Through my web page. You like the cover? Again, that's the cover that I printed the fabric. Henry printed it for me, but I mean, I designed it. Congratulations, Manda. Are you still here? Manda Dawn, Manda, you're welcome. Do I have your address, Manda? I can't remember. You, your name sounds familiar, but I'm not sure. But make sure that you message me if I don't have your address through my web page with your mailing address. Junkie Joe just sent it. Congratulations! Yay! Congratulations! Okay, I've got to sit here and do some work. <laughs> Congratulations, Manda! You too. Thank you for being here. Enjoy your evening. Thank you for the rest of your day. Uh, or, or thank you for being here and, and spending your day with me. I really appreciate it. Thank you for your donations, everyone. Remember to go to my website. Make sure you get your freebies. I'll be adding some more. Thank you so much, Robin. Thank you, thank you. My face hurts from smiling. <laughs> ah. Okay, thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Manda. You're welcome. You're welcome. Congratulations. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All righty, y'all. I'm going to get off here. Y'all have a fabulous rest of your night, and thank you so very much for being here and watching. I'm glad you had fun. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Now you can go eat, Mariana. <laughs> now you can go eat. Uh, Margie, thank you for being here. Robin, Annika, Mary, Mariana. 
Marie, Mary, Manda, Elizabeth, Barbara, Giovanna, Bonnie. Thank you so much, Christy. Y'all have a fabulous night. You're very welcome, Marie. Thank you, thank you. Do I carry a sample pack of Tattered Angels? I have a couple of kits. One of them is called the Bella Rose. The other one's called the um, Royal Peacock. And then I also have the Punked Out Steam. There are six different colors um, in each of those kits. And in fact, if you buy all three kits, they would all be different. They'll be similar but they are different colors. And then I have individual colors. I am going to be adding more colors when I pick up my Tattered Angels for the Punked Out Steam Kit. I'll be adding some more colors. So if there's a color that you're wanting that you want me to have in my shop, message me and I'll get that. And I just posted a link to my Tattered Angels Glimmer Miss. You're very welcome, Christy. You're very welcome, Christy. And <laughs> Christy. <laughs> Bye, Sonia. Bye, Mariana. Thank you, Christy. Bye-bye. Y'all have a fabulous night. Any more questions? You're ordering pizza. I, I can't order pizza. This is not my carb night. <laughs> Y'all have a fabulous night. Thank you so much for being here. I'm going to get ready to shut her down. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All righty, I'm going to get off here. Bye, Janice. Thanks for being here. Bye, Sonia. All right, I'll see you on Messenger, I'm sure, in a little bit. I think I heard a lot of ding, ding, dings in the other room. <laughs> oh, dear. All righty, I'm going to get off here. Y'all have a fabulous night. Thank you again for being here. I greatly appreciate it. Y'all take care, all right? I'm going to hit the stop button now. Bye.